our next vowel sound is e e it is a combination of uh, alif z and choti a alif z and choti a together I'll give a sound of e e alif z was e and alif z and choti a is e e uh, it is uh, like uh, double e in english word seam seam this is the phonetic symbol of e e e e now some words p choti a is p p choti a is p p choti a is p and noon alif is na p choti a is p and noon alif is na p na p na p choti a p and noon alif na p na uh, you are uh, looking this diacritical mark uh, it is called khala zer khala zer it is uh, uh, as uh, you know when choti a and uh, badi a are attached are uh, uh, are joined to other letters their shape disappears and instead instead of it uh, two points means nukta uh, uh, two nukte two nukta uh, are uh, there to represent ye since both choti ye and badi ye are uh, represented by two dots only uh, so how do we uh, know that it is uh, uh, where uh, choti ye or it is badi ye in order to differentiate between them we put this khala ze below two dots uh, when we put this khala ze below two dots it means these two dots represent choti a not badi a if uh, we don't uh, put this khala ze below two dots it means uh it is badi but uh, this is uh, for uh, for beginners this distinction is for beginners and uh, uh, when uh, as you progress further uh, we don't uh, use this uh, diacritical mark also so you you will hardly find it in books or uh, newspapers so so P choti a is P, noon alif is na, P na, P na, and choti a is e, e, and dal, eid, and choti a is e, and dal eid. P na means to drink, and eid, eid is a a Muslim festival. it is a festival of muslims eid eid i am choti a e and dal eid eid we have put the khala zer below two dots it means it is choti a i am choti a e and dal eid eid and the word is There is a bus. The and half tap. There is jazm over half, so there is no vowel sound is attached to half. So the is over half is tap. Re, choti a is re and re, re. Tap rear, tap rear, tap rear. Tap rear means lecture. lecture 
लेक्चर तकरीर तकरीर लेक्चर तकरीर लेक्चर